It's Play, Don't Pay, the game show that teaches you how to play safe, with your suave and debonair host, Sammy Safely. Well, that's right, kids. Play, don't pay. You all know the rules. Right answers get you points. Wrong answers get you squat. First one to 100 points wins. Okay, let's welcome today's contestants, Kyle and Kerry. Okay, hands on your buzzers. Here's today's first question. I'm looking for five answers here. You decide to go out for a bike ride. What would you need to do to stay safe? <coughs> Kyle? Well, I guess you want to make sure your bike's working okay, so you can get home okay, right? Correct. What else? Uh, you'd want to wear a helmet just in case you fell. Uh, you'd want to go to places where there's not too much traffic because not all drivers pay attention to bikes. And you'd want to know your hand signals. Bent arm for left turn, straight arm for right. Ooh, I'm afraid that would be very confusing for the driver behind you. Carrie? Bent arm for right turn, straight arm for left. Never ride against the traffic, only one person per bicycle. No stunts, and make sure you have reflectors. Absolutely right. So Carrie's in the lead with 25 points, and Kyle trails with 15. Next question. Again, we're looking for five answers. You decide to take up skateboarding. What do you need to do to stay safe? <coughs> Carrie. I didn't mean to wear a helmet and padding. I don't skateboard. That's it. Too bad. Kyle? Check your board before you ride. <laughs> Never hitch a ride behind a car. Practice falling. Uh, don't skate in crowds. Five seconds. <laughs> That's it. The last answer was follow your town's laws and only skate where it's allowed. All right, that ends round one. Kyle has taken over the lead with 35 points, but carries right behind with 30. Now it's time for short snappers. Remember, no buzzer. For 10 points each, Name six places where it isn't safe to play. Near power lines, on railway tracks. On busy streets. On ice. Ten seconds. Near bodies of water, near high voltage signs. Excellent. Next one. How do you stay safe around animals? Never tease an animal. Let a dog sniff your hand before you pet it. Don't play with other people's pets. Don't stop animals from fighting. Never feed a wild animal. If you see someone hurting an animal, tell your parents. Correct. Yes. All right, let's see where we are. Kyle is in the lead with 95 points, but Kerry is only five points behind at 90. That means whoever wins the bonus round wins the game. We'll find out who right after these messages. We're back. It's time for the bonus round. All right, here's the question. To win the game, tell me five things you can do to stay safe around water. Time's up. Kyle, you're in the lead, so we'll look at your answers first. To win the game, what is your first answer? Only swim when there's a lifeguard. Well, that's correct. Number two, please. No running or jumping at the pool. That's two correct answers. You need three more to win. Your third answer? Never use a boat or canoe unless an adult's with you. You're right again, Kyle. Number four. Make sure there's a life jacket in your boat. I'm sorry, Kyle. I'm afraid that's incorrect. The right answer is 
always wear a life jacket when you go out on the water. That's too bad, but thanks for playing. All right, Carrie, it's up to you. Five correct answers, and you win. Play, don't pay. What is your first answer? Young kids should have a parent with them in the locker room. Correct. Number two? Alcohol and boats don't mix. Well, that's right. Three. When you and your dad are fishing from shore, wear a life jacket. Well, that's three correct answers. Can I have number four, please? Don't stand in a boat. You're absolutely right. One more correct answer, and you are our new champion. Kerry, for all the marbles, what is your fifth answer? Don't walk out on the ice. That's it. That's it. Boys and girls, Kerry is our new champion. That's all the time we have now. I'll see you next time on Play Don't Pay.